think I was gonna dedicate this one to all the haters. Hey, it's Dominic from the Dominic Natty Show, and I want to tell all of you to subscribe to Off Tap Life. Off Tap Life has the best reactions on all of YouTube. It's right here. So if you're not subscribed, what is wrong with you? What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Always a pleasure to be kicking down a notch all you beautiful souls around the globe. If this is your first time, consider subscribing to join the family. We'd love to have you. And we're back with another reaction request. This one is from Gary H. Gary wants to hear smile. Though your heart is aching. <laughs> smile, doing all right. Uh, he had this to say. He said, let's celebrate Brian May's 75th birthday. Smile is the band Brian May and Roger Taylor and Tim Staffel had before they formed Queen. Bri, Bri, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Bri, Bri. Happy birthday, Bri, Bri. It's Bri, Bri's birthday, guys. So let's wish Bri Bri a happy 75. Glad he's still going strong, doing what he loves, representing Queen, making us all gleam and happy with his sunbeam because he shines bright like a diamond. And you already know. So anyways, look, we're going to go ahead and dive into this without further ado. For me, Gary H. For Bri Bri's 75th birthday for all of you, let's get off tap. Yesterday, my life was in ruin. Now, today, I know what I'm doing. Got a feeling I should be doing all right. Doing all right. Where will I be this time tomorrow? Sinking in sorrow anyway. I should be doing alright. Doing alright. Should be waiting for the sun. Alright, so this is a song we know very well. We've done this song multiple times, the Queen version that is. And it is 
pretty cool to see Bri Bri taking the front vocal action game with his group Smile. And it's kind of fitting because I listen to it. It makes me want to smile. I'm already smiling. Can you see it? <laughs> it's good stuff, man. So since it is, why don't we just keep on uh, listening? Let's go. Anyway, I got too high. Going back to where the sky's not blue. Going home to find the world. If you want to check out my initial reaction to the first time I ever heard this song, check out my previous vids. But let me tell you what I'm feeling right now. I'm feeling that Bri Bri's got vocal chops as we know. It is one of those situations where though, as I've told you guys many times, is that at the end of the day, when you've got Superman Bri Bri on the case, the multi-talented freaking mega guitarist, one of the arguably maybe the best in the whole world in the history of guitar playing action. And then you got freaking his vocals in the mix. This guy is super dope. He's talented. He's great. He's awesome. He is freaking just always operating on fuel ceiling. But like he's just freaking the legit, 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 legit. Just legit, just legit, 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 legit. I don't even know what I said. All I know is that. I freaking respect Bri Bri and the fact that, you know, he's been able to just do something for so long and still be doing it with a smile, <laughs> then, you know, what's, what's not to love? Seriously, this guy is incredible. Love Bri Bri. Love this version of a iconically dope song. What else is there to say except... Hit it. Now today, I know what I'm doing. Got a feeling I should be doing alright. Doing took time to listen to this amazing rendition of a classic Queen song. Bri Bri is probably only the one, probably matter of fact, I would say he is the only one who could dare attempt such a feat without getting any hate from it. Because usually, you know, if we, I don't know, let's just use someone like Lambert that people like to hate on. Personally, I think Adam Lambert's incredible. Some people hate on him. But if Adam Lambert decided, hey, I'm just going to do my own version of doing right right now. I'm going to do it right now. You know, I think it'll be all right if I'm doing it. And uh, a lot of people would hate on it just because who it is. But Bri Bri, you know, original Queen member. Everyone loves Bri Bri. He can't do any wrong. 
you know, it doesn't matter what song he sung. As a matter of fact, he could go in tomorrow and sing a Frank Sinatra song or freaking, you know, Michael Jackson song. It doesn't matter. And people be like, Bri, Bri, what a great guy, you know. So at the end of the day, I think that there's nothing really negative or anything really I could say except that this was awesome. It was great to hear. Um, you know, we have done a few of... Bri Bri's Smile Group songs and also uh, Rogers Group. We've done a couple, few of the, maybe a couple, two, three, I don't know what we've done, but we've done some of them. So it's always good to see the Queen members out and about in their other projects. I think that's what makes Queen incredibly amazing is because basically even though Freddie took the mantle as the, you know, the front man for the group, they all were like front men. <laughs> they all had the ability to be front men. And so therefore they started their own groups or had their own groups even before they had been part of Queen in this case, you know, and they were front men in their groups. So it's kind of like, you know, they got together and be like, hey, let's create a super group. Let's just get a bunch of front men who are like, you know, freaking quadruple threats <laughs> and let's make a group we'll be unstoppable <laughs> that's what they did and because that's what queen is it's just a group of super quadruply talented mofos i can't really speak on deke though because apparently he was kind of the odd person out as far as you know vocally being able to kind of you know hold his own from what i've heard allegedly vocals wasn't his thing but hey look he made up with it for what he did do what he did do he did very well you know what i'm saying he just couldn't freaking do what roger and freaking bri bri and freaking freddie you know they just had another element to their whole ball game you know allegedly i don't know y'all tell me maybe deke was a secret freaking vocal genius but from what i've been told through your comments and through different things I've heard, Deke was just not that guy. But that's okay. Everyone has a role to play. And Queen, they just balanced each other out very well, complement each other very well. So no hate, man. They super group, they awesome. And I like Smile. I think this is a great project and you can kind of see how Smile, you know, was a great lead for Queen. Um, you know, I think that there's always that thing, you know, having, it's nothing wrong. I'm glad that they kept that relations, you know, it's important to keep these relations in check, you know, like just because you start one project doesn't mean you can't still be involved in others. Like, Hey, look, just because I've got a new friend now that I have to get rid of my old friends. So it's, it's great that they still kept their little side piece. Hmm. In my head that, that sounded different because no one wants to find out that someone's got a side piece mm. yeah okay I mean unless you roll like that I mean I guess there's some people out there be like yo hey you do you you do you you do you I could do you 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 we all do 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 so yeah again in my head the do do it yeah that, that crap sounded different <laughs> Anywho, I'm done with this, guys. I'm just freaking, I don't even know, freaking just whatever. Blah, bitty, blue, blah. Thanks for tuning in. Thank you for the reaction request, Gary H. Hey, if you want to do your own reaction request, by the way, you can do so by heading over to offtap.life. It's offtap.life, and you can make it happen. Then I'll drop it in the queue. I'll make it happen for you. Because then, after that, I promise you, you'll be doing all right. <laughs> and you'll smile.
Of our lives dancing in the pool. 